What is up all my fellow Turbos, this is Steve Turbo coming to you with another Street Fighter V character reveal reaction from yours truly. And today we have a brand new character to the franchise and he goes by the name of Rashid. Uh, he's the very first Middle Eastern character for the Street Fighter V, or for the Street Fighter franchise for that matter. Um, so yeah, this is uh, this is gonna be interesting. We're gonna see what this man has to offer. Um, I've only seen a few pictures, and they're very blurry at that. No one seemed to have gotten a really good picture. And I know they posted the trailer, but I've been hunting amiibos all day. But we won't bore you with the semantics here. Let's just get right into it. Let's see what Rashid has to offer. E12. Oh come on! Get rid of that. Get rid of that. What is this? Oh hey man, okay cool. He's got the parkour. Of the turbulent wind. Remember the name that voice sounds familiar. Okay, he's got like a lunge kick, DP, lunge kick. Oh, he's got a CVS2 roll. Okay, okay. Backflip, good sweep. Oh, he's got some traps with him. That lunge kick, man, and he's got a dive kick and a wall jump. Dude's got a lunge kick, dive kick, and a wall jump. Seriously? And he can combo into the whirlwind. Oh, wow. This dude is going to be a pain in the ass. In the right hands, this dude is going to be an absolute pain in the ass. Wow. I got to admit, I'm pretty impressed. I got to admit that I am pretty impressed. So, Rashid looks like he is going to be just a straight up, like, combo monster. He is going to be... I think he's going to be a pretty technical character, though. He's not going to be that type to where you can just go ahead and just bust shit out like nobody's business. He's going to be the kind of flashy technical character, I think, like Seth, who can do some pretty crazy stuff, but he has to be in the right hands. Um, dude's got a ton of tools to make himself great, I think. He's he's definitely really cool in design. I love all the tech that he's wearing. Um, I see he's got kind of like a kind of like a smartwatch here. What looks like a DBZ style power scouter. Uh, this looks kind of like a radio or something. I'm not sure. This dude's like loaded with tech. It looks like. So, I mean, he. I love the design. I think he's really cool looking. Uh, his move set again looks incredibly technical. It makes sense that we have a win character now because we have. Ryu, who's lightning, Chun-Li, who's water, Ken, who's fire. Makes sense that this dude is wind. So, cool. Um, yeah, I like it. I mean, I don't really have much else to say because it didn't really super, like, blow me away like I thought it would. But, I mean, he's definitely a cool addition to the roster. I think he's going to fit in just fine. But I definitely think he's going to end up being a, w a way more technical character than most people are going to want to approach. So, in the right hands, he's going to be dangerous. That much I can say. Um, so... With that said, I mean, I like I like Rashid. I think he looks really cool. We have two more brand new characters coming to us sometime. I don't know when, uh, but we have two left. Um, so next week, actually, on the subject of that, uh, at Tokyo Game Show, we can count on seeing another character reveal. My prediction for that is I think it's going to be Karen, just based on how popular she is in Japan, and that she's been rumored on the leak list for a while. I'm getting more and more bummed at the idea that my, my boy Alex is not going to be in, because according to a very uh, huge letdown through an article uh, after speaking to one of the, representative, uh, uh, one of the representatives at Capcom, um, they said that there are three... Well, before Rashid's reveal, keep in mind, there were three more new characters coming in, well, Rashid being one, so two now. Um, two, one more character who we haven't seen in a while, and I'm assuming that's Karen. And then we have two characters who you would expect to see in a Street Fighter game. So that means more Street Fighter 2 characters, yay. Oh, man. It's probably going to be Zangief and fucking Sagat for some reason. I don't know, man. I'm bummed. I just wanted Alex. That's all. I didn't think that was too tall of an order, but I'm not getting him. But this isn't about that. This is about Rashid. So, with that said, guys, let me know. Let me know what you think of Rashid in the comment section below. Also, let me know who you think they're going to reveal at Tokyo Game Show. Do you think it's going to be Karen, or do you think it's somebody else? And as always, make sure you like this video. Share it to the people who you think would like to watch it, and most of all, hit that subscribe button. It's down here somewhere. It's the big red button. It's hard to miss. Just go ahead and hit that, please, for all the future updates that we have for here on the Hike Bar Arcade Turbo Bros, because you can bet your butt that we are going to be back here next week 
for the Tokyo Game Show character reveal, and we're going to be doing a reaction for that too. If it's Alex, and I really doubt it is, I will freak the hell out. I will absolutely lose my gumballs. If it's Karen, I'll still be happy, because Ms. Karen hasn't seen the light of day in a long, long time. So you know what? It'll all work out. It'll all work out eventually. Until next time, guys, this has been Steve Turbo, and I'll catch you on the flip side.